Results of the foreign currency sale window Wednesday 14 September 2022 Advertisement number 4723. The details the amount total sale for the purposes of strengthening balances abroad, remittances. Credits, 196,365,764 total cash sale, 55,300,000 total total sales, 251,665,764 Note that the selling price of the amounts transferred to bank accounts abroad is 1460 dinars per dollar. The cash sale price is 1460 dinars per dollar. Shafak News, the coordinating coordinating framework, which includes Shiite forces, with the exception of the Sadrist movement, praised on Monday the conclusions of the meeting of the Kurdistan Democratic Party and the Alliance of Sovereignty calling for the formation of a full powers government. The framework expressed in a statement received by Shafak News Agency, his Great appreciation for the national and constitutional position of the Sovereignty Alliance and the Kurdistan Democratic Party after their meeting in Erbil, in which the two parties announced their adherence to the constitutional option in holding early elections after creating the appropriate climates for them and under the supervision of a government with full powers and the return of constitutional institutions to practice their work. Information, Baghdad. The State of Law Coalition confirmed the impossibility of keeping the caretaker Prime Minister, Mustafa al Kazemi, indicating that the government of Muhammad Shia will be permanent and with expanded powers. Member of the coalition, Khalid al Saray, said in a televised statement that Muhammad Shia al Sadani was not a point of contention, and that his Next government is not temporary, and parliament is the one who determines its term. He added that the dissolution of parliament must be in accordance with constitutional controls and that the doors for dialogue with the Sadrist movement have been open for three months. al Saray indicated that the understanding with the sovereignty and democracy was resolved before the Erbil meeting and that the survival of Mustafa al kazemis government will complicate the political, security, and social crisis, as corruption has become blatant during his reign. And at 25d. Shafak News, the American, National Review, magazine saw, on Tuesday, that there is an opportunity available for the United States to seize, in order to pressure Iran and stop coddling it, calling for undermining Tehran's grip in Iraq, by supporting the movements of Sadrist leader Muqtada al-Sadr, in cooperation with Saudi Arabia and the UAE. The American report, translated by Shafak News Agency, stated that in light of the major crisis, now in Iraq, Iran is trying to maintain its influence there, although its strategic position is eroding. Considering that Washington has a clear opportunity to curb Iranian power, calmly and cautiously. And it must seize this the opportunity to press more to weaken Tehran's focus and undermine its grip on Iraq. The part of the Middle East the report identified the importance of Iraq to Iran, saying that it is at the heart of its interests in the Middle East, and that it is the only Shiite majority country in the region except for Iran, and that it enjoys huge oil reserves, and it constitutes a potential route for the illegal export of oil, adding that it is a cemetery for American and Baathist power. It is also a geographical bridge linking the Zagros Mountains with the Mediterranean Sea. Therefore, the report believes that Iraq should fall under Iran's control. If it seeks to be a regional power, considering that pressure on Iran's proxies in Syria, as the Donald Trump administration did at least secretly, will lead to curbing Iran's power, but the pressure on Iran in Iraq, it would represent a mortal threat to Iran's strategic interests in the region. Well-informed Iraqi political sources in Baghdad and Erbil revealed, on Monday, to Al-Arabi.
al jadid preconditions for the sovereignty alliance the largest sunni arab political forces in iraq and the ruling kurdistan democratic party in the kurdistan region before entering into any understandings with the forces of sovereignty coordination framework these conditions relate to the question of forming a government or activating the work of the current parliament the sources confirmed that the two political parties agreed to unify their vision regarding the current crisis taking into account maintaining their rapprochement with the sadr movement led by muqtada al sadr the latter continues his refusal to enter into any political dialogue as well as his opposition to the return of the deputies of his resigned bloc from parliament through the gate of the federal court a member of the patriotic union of kurdistan hassan ali confirmed the continuation of Negotiations with the Kurdistan Democratic Party regarding the position of the presidency. Ali said in an interview with the Information Agency, negotiations regarding the presidency are continuing, and there is progress in negotiations to resolve the file of the presidency of the republic before the next parliament session is held. He added that there is no truth in what is going on in the political and media circles about the agreement to nominate a consensual candidate between the two parties for the presidency of the republic.